Alright, before doing any maintenance, always unplug the spark plug. Now I'm going to show you how I wash my Honda HRX lawnmower. Uh, I don't do this every time I use it, but periodically. Now on the HRX, you want the oil dipstick down and the air filter up when you tilt it over. And then I'm going to just scrape out any big chunks. I'm not going for perfection here, I'm just trying to get all the chunks out. Now I'm going to use a pressure washer to get the underside really clean. The HRX has a plastic deck, so it's really nice being able to clean it and not worrying about rust. And it's also pretty easy to get this stuff off of it uh, because it's plastic. Now this is an electric pressure washer, so I'm not worried about it actually taking any paint or anything off that. It's actually pretty gentle. Um, so if you have a, a high pressure one, I would just make sure that you're getting the, the junk off but not taking any paint off. All right, now you can notice that I'm changing the setting on the uh, pressure washer to be not as harsh of a spray. I'm just looking to rinse things off. There shouldn't really be too much stuck on the top side. For a really nice shine, I like to use a car wash soap to uh, scrub the outside deck. Since it's made out of bumper material, it really does get nice and shiny like a car would. So you might as well use it and make it look amazing. Now obviously soap suds staying on there would be a bad thing so I'm just letting it rinse off now. I like to run it afterwards to make sure everything's still working, that you didn't mess anything up, and also to dry the underside. You don't want the deck to stay wet so when you go to cut that everything sticks. And if you have a metal deck, you really don't want the underneath to be wet because that's how it's going to end up rotting. All right, now I like to put it out in the sun where it's gonna dry off. Look how sparkly clean it's looking. 
I also have a tip on how to uh, make it dry a little bit faster and get the metal stuff to actually dry off quicker so it doesn't rust. I like to take my blower and just start blowing all the water off the metal stuff. Plastic won't rust, but all the metal will, and I like to just leave it nice and dry. 